New at 10 and only on two, a man blaming Centerpoint Energy for destroying his property while doing pipe installation in the area. Yeah, he says this all happened north of downtown back in April or May, and they still haven't returned to fix it. Tonight, he is speaking exclusively to our Devin Clark, who was able to get the utilities company to respond quickly. The man you're about to hear from says he understands the need for major companies like Centerpoint to do work throughout the city, even if that means entering people's properties. But what he says he doesn't get is why they came here and left him with this dangerous mess some six months later. Ernesto Ferrari says he hasn't been able to fully use his front yard since the spring. Cuando Centerpoint o el del gas pusieron los caños nuevos. He says when Centerpoint put down new pipes, they broke all the ground up and never came back. Que lo arreglen, si ellos lo rompieron. Ferrari feels if they broke it, they should fix it. Afuera también, allá, yo no me puedo parquear porque me caigo. In addition to his yard being ruined, Ferrari says he can no longer park his truck outside his home because the materials that Centerpoint used to fill this area in with are so soft that when he does park here, his truck slides into the ditch. And then when he tries to park on the street, he says he gets a ticket. Vengo con la troca así, vroom. He adds the area is now a constant eyesore that also floods. Si no, mira ya como se hunde. But following months of what seemed like a hopeless situation, after we contacted Centerpoint, they contacted Ferrari with good news. So we asked Centerpoint why it's taken so long to get a solution to this problem. While they couldn't really give us an answer, they did promise to have a crew come out here immediately and at least put a temporary fix down here so that Ferrari can park his truck until tomorrow where they are going to begin permanent solutions. But we did see a truck come out here for about five minutes and then it left. Reporting live north of downtown, Devin Clark, KPRC, 2 News. Way to get some answers, Devin. Thank you.